Leo's, we the last ones. Thank God, because I'm about to go to sleep. Okay? <laughs> um, Leo's. Hopefully, this is us. No, it's Virgo. Virgo been making his way. You could have Virgo on your chart. You could be dealing with a Virgo. There's a fake spiritualist in here. There is a Virgo. And I'm sorry if you watch me. I'm so sorry. But there is a Virgo that is a fake spiritualist that's been making his way throughout all my readings. Somebody that does black magic just to do it, okay? Some of this should be justified. Y'all know, y'all know, y'all know, y'all. Anyway, I'm like, Because some people have to, okay. You know, they be, they be violating other people's spiritual energy. So you have to protect yourself. And some people think it's dark or whatever it may be because of the outcome of certain situations. But, I mean, what, if some guy is holding you a gun, holding a gun to your head and there's a gun inside of you or something to protect yourself, what you gonna do? Protect yourself, period. But it's somebody that just does things without doing, without getting facts, without knowing what's going on. Um, that like to steal spiritual gifts, use money, they're money hungry and greedy. Leo's. So some of you guys may know this person. They may have Virgo in their chart. Who okay, so from some of you Leos, you're spiritual yourself. And this other spiritual is in competition with you. It's a spiritual battle. Spiritual warfare. Oh god, why are they doing that? Yeah, why are they doing that? Because they just gonna bring hard times to themselves. They trying to inv they trying to get you out the picture. They trying to make you be invisible. They about to do it to themselves. Let me tell you, okay? STD. Somebody trying to give somebody a spiritual STD as well. Okay, go watch Taurus reading if y'all know any Taurus in y'all. Yeah, Sagittarius could have been the one that was doing this, trying to give you an STD. Yeah, manipulating you. Ooh, trying to harm you. It's like somebody had an STD, wanted to manipulate it, and like they wanted to be with you to give it to you so they can have sex with you without a condom just to still be a player. Oh my God, Lord. <laughs> What's going on, Spear? I'm on the way in love with you. Hell no. Nah. Y'all got a crazy person in love with you. All you got to do is say yes. <sighs> Don't deny what you feel. Baby undressed, you see this person is using all type of temptation, attraction to will you in. Some of these people said, well, if I can't have you, I'm about to make this person get caught up in a court case to get the authorities involved. So hopefully they about to call me and ring, give me a ring so I can get them out of jail. So they can feel like they owe me something. Oh my God, spirit, stop playing. Y'all better get this man, <laughs> get this woman, get him. What the hell? Somebody said, get him before I get him. Pay attention. They have bad intentions towards you. Thank you. I said get them asking this y'all be received. Call them fucking busted. The fuck? You can't try to hold on to somebody that's self-made. Somebody is trying to have a, 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 a fucking court to your finances, Leo. Because they're truly in love with you. But yet they want a breadcrumb you. Talking about I need you. Some of y'all, this could be a... Pe Ooh, secretly cheating or creeping at night. The devil, they're toxic. And it's a breakup that's coming from this for some of y'all y'all been dealing with somebody that's been having somebody else on the side and they've been secretly cheating and creeping that night and now it's a breakup coming and they want to come back to you your ancestor said and i feel like for some of y'all y'all might be done with this person because you might even found out about the other person so you put them off to the side right like hell no i'm not a fucking third party going back to my other reading i'm not the third party right this person gonna go fucking crazy they gonna probably gonna be like well you was the cause of the breakup so you owe me this you owe me messing with me what? Boy. Where my Leo at? This supposed to be a quick little reading. Where is my Leo at? Leo, give me the card. Where y'all at? If I can't find y'all in two minutes, I'm going to just get to the reading. But Leo's, what's going on, Leo's? I need to see y'all. <laughs> Virgo again. Hmm. Hmm. Memories. No matter how far you go, I'm going to always be close. They ain't trying to let you go. They ain't trying to let you go. But what did I say? They're fucking non-committal. Some of you guys, this could be somebody in your family. They're using a third party. And for some of y'all, this third party is a part of your family. Don't fucking stop. 
All right, stop opening up your heart to these fucking karmic ass, corrupt, crooked ass people that's hiding evidence on something. They hid evidence on something that was very serious when it came to you. Okay, and they gonna be the ones ashamed and regret in the end. Yeah, and they using somebody to copy you. All right, it's okay to cry. You know, right? Somebody could even be feeling possessed, like they having bad dreams. Somebody's about to say, I'm sorry. Yeah, create the life that you want. You might even have to get a lawyer because it's about to be a transformation. So I'm, I'm hearing somebody lied. Somebody made a whole lot of lies and just to try to, yeah, trying to manifest you back in. Somebody is crazy knowing what I want. Like, does this, per this person needs to get in a fucking... You should not be getting in trouble for none of this shit. If you do, I mean, I'm hearing lawsuit. Okay, social media. It has something to do with social media. Reach out, mother figure. Yeah, because this person's been getting readings on you and divining on you. And there's some knowledge about that, too. There's going to be an unexpected change. It might have to do with work. They think you're a test dummy love cycle. Yeah, work. They could even be lying saying we're working together, but just trying to have you in a love cycle. Yeah, you might be going on vacation, wishing death on you. And then we have Libra right here. There's a Libra that may be wishing death on you. Pay attention to your vision and your dreams when it comes to this person. This person could be secretly jealous as fuck of you. Yeah, and they are using you as a case study. They got all eyes on you and they got every, they, there's a lot of eyes on you. Oh my goodness, stop ignoring the red flag. There's an arrest that is coming. Somebody gonna get arrested. Love spell. See, somebody is crazy putting love spells on people. I'm looking for Leo. Did somebody put cameras in your house? All right. Well, I guess Scorpio. That could be dealing with a Scorpio. This person could have Scorpio in their chart. Gemini as well, too. I'm about to just start this reading. Aries in here. All right, there's too many people. It's time to let it go, messing you. So if somebody messing you, they want you back. But I feel like the way they're going about it is ridiculous. It's, in, it's beyond insane. Beyond insane? Watching you? Y'all, they're fucking watching you and shit. Like, I don't know who think this is right. And it could even be, like, your family that's doing this shit. And trying to justify the reason why they're watching you. Like, there's no justification. To, I'm gonna keep you safe. No, bitch, you have a problem. You have a mental issue. Bitch, I didn't authorize this. Let it be somebody mother or father, too. And you a grown-ass motherfucker. For instance, like me. I'm about to be 30 motherfucking years old. So if one of my fucking mom or my motherfucking dad was to put cameras in my house, unwillingly known by me... I don't know about this. I'm just doing it for your safety. Bitch, you got me fucked up. I'm going to go fuck who you are, bitch. I'm a grown-ass motherfucking woman. That's like me going to put cameras in their motherfucking house, right? When they gone, I'm just doing it for your safety. They're going to be like, bitch, you got me fucked up. That's invasion of motherfucking privacy. Bitch, what the fuck is you watching me for? I'm going to go fuck how I sound. That's sick. That's sick. These about to irritate me. Like, oh, I hate when I get these readings that irritate me like this. Because this is bad intentions, period, point blank. You can't run around to this bad intentions. They can try to manipulate it for whatever reason they want to manipulate it for. It was all through bad intentions. It was never no good intention. Pay attention when it came to what the fuck they did to you. And it strongly could be a Pisces involved in this. Your ancestors said, pay a fucking attention. They just tried to fucking breadcrumb you. They tried to lie to you. Okay? They're frenemies of yours and they're being fucking careless as fuck. It's time for you to revise, rethink, and go over some things. And there go fucking Leo. Leo, spirit said, you need to put a little umph in this. I need to know that you see this. You could be over love because it could be your whole family dealing with your ex-lover off of what your stability or a capricorn that was blinking blockages and your disturbances to what what did i say in the beginning your fucking finances okay all these motherfucking people leo the fuck because you put on you put on for everybody and they know it and they got jealous of you it's crazy because i'm hearing these people got mad at you but really they need to be better at themselves because they fumbled you they fucked you over and now they're pissed off and now they're mad because you see through they bullshit you won't fuck with them and now they missed out on the opportunity when it comes to you and now they pissed off with you but they need to be pissed off with themselves because they fucked this up they did it to themselves they did it to themselves hey man energy they did it to themselves. They say not rope. It looked too good to be true. And they started pulling that shit. Alright. Well. 
What's going on with my Leo spirit? What's going on, my Leos? Got ahead of themselves, got beside themselves. What's going on, my Leos? What's going on? Ooh, shit. Too much, huh? Somebody mad as fuck because somebody's like, I put on for my city. Or I could have, I wanted to. See, it's like somebody was trying to. Like, again, they fucked up. I feel like people are fucked up because they fucked up an opportunity. You were somebody that was trying to come and help. The, uh, man, in whatever way that you was trying to help, they took it as you going against them. I'm hearing there was so many rumors and gossip about you, right? To the point that it fucking made start. It, it fucked with people's image to the point that they weren't able to see what was really going on. Right? It's like somebody was trying to go out there and kill somebody that was there to help them. And warn them about shit. But these people, all oh, this, because somebody else in the back of the in the back of the picture that was jealous of you in competition with you, possibly another spiritualist. Okay, somebody is spiritual because it's that fake spiritualist in competition with you, in competition with you because you are leveling up ahead of them. So they bring in all this smut to create this conflict because they know they got some light of their own. And if it comes to surface, they can ruin them. So they're trying to ruin you before you try to ruin them. You ain't even worrying about they stupid ass. That's how much they all up in your energy space. They worrying about the wrong motherfucking shit, right? To the point that they gon' they ruin they they did it to themselves. They did it to themselves. They did it to themselves. It's like people was shouting and and saying this about somebody or this is what they was doing or this is what that is, right? It wasn't even that to the point that they started manifesting it on their own. They started bringing in some type of attention. That they shouldn't have bring, brought into themselves because it wasn't even that. But they made it get to that by listening to the manipulation and the lies. Now it's all of that. Somebody's stupid. They fell right into the fucking trap. I put on for my city. What's going on, my Leos? What's going on, my Leos? Hello? Open to love. Somebody's over love, but they're saying open to love. Focus on children in reverse. You, on the other hand, you said, fuck this shit. I'm not open. Somebody is not feeling nothing new. No new kids. No new none of that. Somebody's just over love, over relationships, over all that shit. But Spirit is saying, don't give up just yet. Stay open and stay optimistic about your love life. Optimistic about your love life, I meant to say. But, I mean, I feel you, whoever this is, because after all of this, the people close to you, your family, working with people that you don't even know, and your supposedly lovers and people that you like and want to be with, and they're bringing you down, bringing smuts and lies on you, trying to tear down your name, tear down your image, rob you, take from you, hurt you. Like, who can you trust? Who can you love? The universe said me. That's all you need is me. Some of y'all got children. You need to focus on your children. Some of you, like, I, all I need is my children and that's it. No more. I feel like spirit is trying to bring a baby or bring some blood. There's a baby or there's a relationship that is trying to come through and you on the other end are saying no. You're saying no. Clarify, focus on children in reverse and open to love. Yeah, three of swords in reverse and page of wands in reverse. You, on the other hand, you don't get excited about... You feel like it's a bad... You don't get excited about this person or this situation no more. Four of cups in reverse. Four of pentacles in reverse. It's like these people were trying to make you stay with somebody that was not make having you happy. What? That has you in a third-party relationship and you know that. It's something hidden from you. You are a high priestess. These people were trying to have you stuck in a karmic-ass relationship or cycle. Where it's like, there's, this is just filled with lies and betrayal. Why are you trying to keep me here? Why? Why you keep trying to make it seem like you got my back when y'all know you don't? Like, why? It's like, the more and more you stayed, the more and more it was just irritating and it was just, like, painful. Like, I'm not happy here and you not happy. So why are we doing this? Clarify, focus on children in reverse and open to love. Somebody is like, I'm open to love, but I don't want no I don't want no more babies. I don't need no more children. 
especially if you somebody like me, three kids already, just got, guys, like, I just want you to have my baby. So you can leave me, so you can go and cheat, because I'm not going to stay when you do me wrong. That's what I'm not about to do. I don't believe that's a part of ups and downs. You going out and being a whore and you doing things you know better than thinking with the wrong thing. You know, like that's not a part of that. And I don't have to stick through that. So somebody is like, yeah, I could, I might want a little relationship, but I don't, somebody might need to get on birth control or something. Or just stay abstinent, abstinent, celibate. Abstain from sex, yeah, but somebody's being manipulative. It could be a mother figure of yours in here. It could be a mother in here being very manipulative, manipulating a situation. Some of you guys, you guys, that's black magic in reverse. Somebody is trying to keep you in a toxic situation. Somebody is messing with somebody's um, uterus female hormones and shit to stop you from having a baby. Somebody don't want somebody to have a baby. They say, yeah, you can have love, but I don't want you getting pregnant. See, somebody think they control you. Y'all have a, a, a overbearing... Mm. Y'all, justice could be a Libra in here. This cycle has came to a completion. Somebody's like, I was not using my judgment when it came to this situation. I'm wrapping this shit the fuck up. Okay, I was not using my judgment. I'm walking away. I see you and me ain't meant to be at all. It was a waste of time and a bad investment. All these secrets keep coming out about this side person and mistress, okay? You in the relationship, stalking me, watching me. I'm done. How the fuck does this work? How the fuck does this work? How? Somebody's like crazy. Somebody's like, hmm. Yeah, it's time for you to release this shit. What's going on, spirit? Forever, Pisces. Some of y'all got a Pisces that's infatuated with you. It ain't even love. It's infatuation. You're so close. Yeah, get some rest. Somebody could be on drugs and alcohol. This is a test. They trying to test you. Yeah, somebody wants forever with you because of some type of big purchase that you may be working towards. And they're going broke. And now they're talking about they're your true love. What the? No, they're not. And they're using your kids to get back at you? Y'all, so what? You're independent. They know you're independent. It's time for you to free yourself, okay? It's time for you to free yourself. Yeah, from this love cycle that they have and all this gang stalking. You guys. Your family and your friends. Mm, 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 mm. I wouldn't even deal with nobody that know my family. I said this already, and I'm I'm standing full term, full stand. I'm standing firm on this. My next relationship, this man is not meeting my family. I don't care. My mama gonna say we need to see him. Y'all don't need to see shit. Y'all need to meet nobody. <laughs> Nothing against that, no. Because y'all have people in y'all family, and I. How you know? Why you? Why you talking? What is? No, it's just like no, no, no. And they're gang stalking you, acting like you're not, and trying to justify the reason why they're gang stalking you. Like, you guys need fucking meds, and it seems like they're trying to feed you meds to try to say you're along with somebody does drugs, and they're trying to give you drugs, bitch. Mm, okay, all right. Somebody's been lying, saying that you are on drugs. Somebody has been feeding you drugs, small doses. Give it back. Hello, give it back. Somebody's wearing a false appearance. Okay, and you need to get a restraining order against these people from your fucking home. And it's not a joke. At this point, your family ain't even your family no more. They're not. I love y'all so much. Take care.